So I usually use my multimeter as a power probe. Well, I can't afford a power probe, so I use my multimeter to do the similar thing. So basically this is like a circuit. Positive, comes to the positive post, negative going to the, through the body ground to a light. So let's just say that the light is faulty. Just get your multimeter. Go to 20 amps DC. Well, mine's 20 amps, some are usually the 10 amps. You connect your red lead to the 20 amp max socket. Leave your common in your common. You touch this to your positive side. You brought your black one up, I don't think it really matters which side, and then you can use it to provide power. Let's try and see it the other way. Yeah, it doesn't really matter which way you go, but best to use your red one to provide the positive. And it even gives you, if you look at the meter, basically you just using it really to read the amps, but I use it to re give power as well to some things like fans light bulbs don't use it on a starter motor though you can use it on radiator fans injectors light bulbs indicator bulbs things like that but don't use it on your starter because your starter will probably blow the fuse it's only 20 amps on this one yours will probably only be 10 so just be careful with starter motors plus if you touch to there, this is now live when you're on amps. So if you touch your body, you'll blow the fuse in your meter as well. So just be careful when you're doing it.